new from overnight. Huber Heights police officers are looking for a man who hit a cruiser and then took off. That crash on Tom Berg and Powell followed a low-speed chase through the city. Jordan Burgess is live at the Huber Heights Police Department with this morning's top story. Well, right now, police here in Huber Heights are still searching for that man in the area of a creek. They have some canine units out, but they haven't been able to find him yet. Now, authorities still aren't sure this morning why the man decided to take off in the first place, but he certainly tried hard to get away. Take a look at what the man did to his car when he rammed a cruiser here on Powell Road following a brief chase. Now, that officer was taken to the hospital after complaining of neck pain, but he's expected to be okay. His cruiser barely had a scratch on it, and afterwards, he tried to chase down the man on foot. Later, canines did the searching. Police tell us the officer at first tried to pull the man over just before 3 a.m. for running a stop sign, but the man kept going. Authorities say speeds never got that high during the chase. Police did what they could to get the man off the road. It was kind of a short pursuit. We didn't get a chance to get stop sticks out. He bailed out right here on Powell, and uh, we didn't get a chance to get stop sticks or get in position to put him out safely. So uh, it started to turn into a foot, foot pursuit later. And police tell us at this point, while they're not sure why the man decided to run, he certainly made things much worse for himself. Now he could face felony charges, not only for running from police, but also for running into that officer. And we'll keep you updated throughout the morning on the search for the driver. But for now, reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 2 News on your side.